becoming the darkest captain of the hunter ship in Blocks Fruits. And if you don't know what is that, you're about to find out. But here's the game plan. Getting the Hellfire Torch, unlock the Ghoul Race, obtaining the Dark Fruit and awakening it, upgrading to Ghoul V2 and V3, getting the Shadow Fruit, and then becoming the darkest and most powerful captain V4. Shiver runs down your spine. The first thing we need to do is get the Hellfire Torch. And hopefully we can kill it within the time limit. If we don't kill him within the time limit, he's gonna despawn. So let's do this really fast and get that torch. Come on, everybody. Give me the torch. Give me the torch right now. Hopefully we're doing good damage. We don't have the dark fruit yet or the shadow fruit. So we're using which is really, really not strong. <laughs> And I'm dead. No. Okay, okay, okay. I gotta go fast. I gotta go fast. That is one minute down the drain. Come on, just die, bro. Just die. Just don't fight back, you know? You don't need to fight back because I am not strong. You don't need to fight back. Ah, no. We are already two minutes in. He despawns in 10 minutes. So I gotta go really, really fast. At least we are already halfway his HP. Please do not despawn, okay? Oh, we're gonna get that torch right now. Give me the torch. Give me the Elfire torch right now. Are we gonna get it on our first try? And... Yo, we just unlocked the Night Edge. What is that title for? We just unlocked the Night Edge. But we didn't get the Hellfire Torch. So let's get this fruit. We need to get a Dark Fruit and Awaken it. Okay, we are two meters away. And let's see the fruit. And we are zero meters away. And let's see. And we just got an Ice Fruit. Maybe people would accept this for Dark Fruit. Because they would just give away Dark Fruit, right? Let's see. Let's store this one. Okay, now let's try to roll a fruit from Zeolis. Zeolis is going to give me a Dark Fruit or a shadow fruit watch he is giving me a rubber Ooh, do you guys think people would accept rubber for dark fruit maybe that is a big chance that we can get a dark fruit for this one so right now we are just a regular human being for us to become a real ghoul we need that hellfire torch the hellfire torch is an item that can be obtained with around one to two percent two percent only way to increase the drop chance is game pass and we can only get it from the raid boss curse captain Factories open. Factories open. I didn't see factories open. Let's go. Let's go. We got to kill this really fast. I think it might be open for a while now. Let's try to kill it really fast. Hopefully, we get something good from it so we can get the dark fruit. Let's go. Give me... Hey, no. No. And I unlocked the title. The lost soul. My soul was lost. Are you kidding me? I was AFK when the factory opened. No. We have another fruit detected. And it's going to be right here. So close. That's good. Okay, we are now one meter away. And what is this fruit? Another ice fruit. Yo, we just got two ice fruit from this one. Back to back. Let's try to get it again. Hopefully, this time we get it. Type in torch right now so we can get the hellfire torch. Ah, this guy is so strong. What the hell? It's either he's strong or my character is weak. That's why we need to become a ghoul. Are we gonna get the torch? Give me, give me, give me the hellfire. Give me the hellfire right now. If we kill him, with the spin he's gonna give it for sure we gotta kill it with spin we can kill it with spin if the spin is strong but it's not he's almost dead though we gotta hurry up this guy can despawn yes and we didn't get it but we got a lot of mastery for our spin fruit okay let's try to get something good this time La uh, last time i didn't have enough time and i died but this time we're gonna have enough time and we are getting a well fruit dark Instead of dark fruit, we got a light fruit. Oh, let's roll for a fruit. Maybe you're gonna give me dark fruit this time. Come on, give me dark fruit. Smoke. So we just got a light fruit and a smoke fruit. For sure, we can trade that light fruit for dark fruit. Getting the Hellfire Torch is harder than I thought. When you don't need it, you get it on your first try. When you really need it, it's going to take you days to get it. Come on, give me... And there is no torch. No torch again. Again. Okay, let's get the fruit. Okay, we are now six meters away. Is this going to be a dark fruit? Oh, we're going up. We're going up. And it's a flame. Not bad, but not as good as we want. This might be the one. You might... This might be the hellfire torch. <laughs> ah, man getting this guy strong okay we got fruit every time i do this there's fruit detected okay come on man just die just give me the torch give me the torch right now why is your aim so good and give me the torch please please torch please torch 
torch. There is no torch. What is going on? Okay, let's get this fruit. Okay, fruit is 10 meters away. Let's get it. And it's going to be magma fruit store. And Zeolis is going to give me... Come on, give me dark fruit. Give me dark fruit. Revive. We just got dark revive. Let's get this once and for all. Come on, man. Give me the torch. Give me the torch. And yo, we finally unlocked the ghost. And we also got the hellfire torch. After like 24 hours, we finally got it. And this fruit is going to be two meters away. And it's going to be flame fruit again. Again and again and again and again and again. Okay, right now we are just human. And human V1 doesn't have any buff. Okay, let's check out the goal. Goal version 1. Slightly increased regen. 30% extra run speed during night. So the goal is going to be 30% faster at night against human. Let's put that on the test. Okay, right now, our character is human. We're going to put a timer and we have to cross the bridge all the way through. Are you guys ready? 3, 2, 1. One, go. Okay, we are five seconds. We are at 20 seconds and we haven't passed the bridge. 30 seconds. And we are going to finish at 36 seconds. So with human, it took 36 seconds to cross the bridge. Now let's find out with ghoul. To get the ghoul race, you gotta go back to the hunted ship. Go inside. There's gonna be a guy over here. How much would it cost us? Then you need to talk to Gordon Ramsay right here. <laughs> Garden, how much would you charge me? Would you like to trade 100 ectoplasm for ghoul race? Is that all I need? There you go. And we are now a ghoul. Look at my horns. Rate this drip right now from 1 to 10. What would you give this drip? Look at it. With the horn, okay? With the horn. Now that it's nighttime, the time to beat is 36 seconds. Let's see if this is going to be 30% faster. In 3, 2, 1. Go. For 6 seconds, 7 seconds, 36 seconds is the time to beat. And I think we're going fast. And what will be our time with the go race? Time, 30 seconds. So that was six seconds faster. So it is true that ghoul race is faster at night. Now it's time for us to get the dark fruit. Come on, Zeolith. Give me the dark spider. We just got a spider fruit. I like this one. I like this one. Okay, okay. We got some good fruits. It's time for us to trade. Trading my light fruit for dark fruit. This should be easy. Oh, he doesn't have space for light. How about rubber? Okay, rubber for dark. Come on, give it to me. This is kind of like an okay trade. Not the best trade, but dark is not that expensive. Yes, sir. And we just got our dark fruit. It's time to eat the dark fruit. Eat the dark fruit. Yes, sir. We did it. We got the dark fruit. So here's some good news and some bad news. The good news is we already got the dark fruit. The bad news is we still need to get the shadow fruit. The good thing about dark fruit, we only need 110 mastery. That's pretty good. That's pretty, pretty good. I like that. And let's see. Let's kill all the bosses here. Get all the mastery. Diamond is gonna give me how much mastery will Diamond give us? Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Let's go, let's go, let's go. And we unlock the new skill the black spiral and it gave us 75 mastery we need five more to get the black hole give me the mastery i need and we just unlock the black hole we need 20 more mastery to unlock the dark bomb give me the mastery please please give me the mastery yes i'm gonna unlock yes we just unlocked the dark bomb and we are now at mastery 129 that is actually the easiest mastery i've ever got dark fruit is one of the best fruit for pvp it has four skills i'm gonna show you guys every single skills of unawakened dark we got the dark rocks dark rocks your face we got this black spiral you can do oh my god Ooh -hoo -hoo. that was pretty cool we got the black hole And then we got the dark bomb. Ooh, that was pretty cool. Now it's time to awaken our dark fruit. Okay, let's try to get this awakened. And before we can do that, we have to open up the code red, blue, green, blue. If you guys don't know, now you know the code right here. Dark raid 100k. Oh, and we unlock the professor. And we also unlock the green tea color. That's pretty good. Okay, now let's do this. Ooh, nobody wants this. Nobody wants this. 
This is a revamped dark, by the way. It looks really good. And our first awakening. We're gonna be awakening the dark rocks. So it's called dark rocks right now. And after awakening 500, at least we have we have the money. And we just unlocked yeah. the title Dark Lord. And dark rocks is now called the dimensional slash. Let's do our second raid right now. Buy this normal dark. Let's go. And our second awakening would be the black spiral. The black spiral is going to be 2,000 fragments. So we have 2,000 fragments. We have 2,000 fragments, of course. And we just upgraded our black spiral. Oh, no, no, no. We got the ghastly step, actually. That is an additional escape for you. Watch this. Ooh. Did you know that you can hit NPC with your boat? Watch this one. Ooh, look at this. I'm gonna kill you guys. Go. I'm damaging the NPC right now. Yo, this guy got into my boat. Oh, that guy got into my boat. But I can damage them. Watch. Boom. <laughs> dead and our third awakening this one for sure is the black spiral let's see how much it's gonna cost us it's going to cost us it's the letter x ability the black spiral and it's cost three thousand fragments expensive and black spiral is now called the abyssal darkness I'm going to show you guys every single skills once we fully awaken it. We got fruit detected. Remember, we still need to get that shadow fruit. Maybe Zeolis is going to give us the shadow fruit. And he gave us a kilo fruit. Amazing. And the fruit is right here again. And I'm flying. And the fruit will be... Where is the fruit? Oh, it's right here. Right here. What the... Why am I flying? And the fruit is sand fruit. Remember, we still have the spider fruit. Maybe we can do some trades to get that shadow fruit. I'm going to show you guys why gold. Gold race is so underrated right now nobody's actually using gold race everybody's using shark or human race and for us to get that gold race we need to talk to the alchemist again it appears you don't have a life my power okay we need to get the flowers the red flower the yellow flower yes and if you guys don't know, dark fruit is Logia. This guy can't even hit me. And blue flower. So now that we got the three flowers, what is the difference between Go V1 and Go V2? Go V2, Life Leech is enabled each time the user hits a player using a fighting style heals 25% of the damage done to said player. Same thing except player heals 5% of damage to NPC. So if I hit an NPC, that's gonna be a 5% Life Leech coming back to my HP. And if I hit a player, that is 25%. Is is that going to be only for nighttime or is it also going to be enabled for daytime i'm not sure it didn't say only nighttime it didn't say anything about nighttime or daytime but let's try it out on daytime and nighttime it's time to upgrade to v2 and 500k and we just evolve our race we said character and we just unlock the title the ghoul so let's get our hp a little bit low okay now our hp is low now we're gonna try to hit him Okay, we're gonna try to hit this guy over here since they can't hit us. Okay, this one over here. 5%. Am I getting any 5% HP? Maybe. Kinda going up. I don't really feel it. Maybe it's nighttime? Or is it it's still nighttime? I don't really see it though. Maybe because 5% is too low. Okay, okay. Kinda, kinda. You kinda see it a little go up a little bit faster. Okay, now let's try it on a player. This is my HP right now. It should show a little bit of a big gap okay oh look at that every hit you see that you see that help yes sir every hit look it gives 25 percent hp hey hold on hold on the factory is breaching in 30 seconds we still need to get a shadow fruit so like the video right now so we can get that shadow fruit abyssal darkness Give me the shadow fruit. Everybody type in shadow right now. We need that. We need that for us to become the strongest ghoul in blocks fruits. This is it. This is it. Yes. We just got a Venom oh Fruit. Everybody like the video right now. Everybody type in W. Yo, I think, I think we can get a Shadow Fruit later on. What do you guys think? What do you guys think? Do you guys think we can get the Shadow Fruit for Venom? What do you guys think? Now let's test if the Life Leech is going to work in morning. It actually works. It actually works in the morning. Day and night, it works. That is actually pretty good. I didn't even know that it works in mornings too. I thought it only works at nighttime. You know what I forgot? I forgot about the gold mask. We need to get the gold mask. Do we need to talk to this guy? Is this the guy to talk to? Talk to this guy. Sorry, you need 25 ectoplasm to make a deal with me. 25, okay? Okay, let's get this ectoplasm to like maybe 500 ectoplasm in three, 
two, one, boom. And we just got 566 ectoplasm. That was fast, right? Just a snap of a finger, we have 566. Now, what can we get with ectoplasm? What is L. Rodolfo selling? Let's see, what are you selling? Would you like to trade 25 ectoplasm for bizarre rifle? Oh, this bizarre rifle. Trade. And we just got the bizarre rifle. Oh my goodness. This one has 300 mastery? How do you level this up to 300 mastery? What else can we buy? Okay, how about this one? El Perro. What is El Perro selling? Would you like to trade 50 ectoplasm for ghoul mask? This is what we're looking for, the ghoul mask. Oh, yes, sir. We just got the ghoul mask. Look at this. The buffs of the ghoul mask. The ghoul mask grants user ability to health equivalent to portion of the damage they deal with the melee attacks known as life leech. The user gains equivalent to 10% of their dealt damage to players and 2.5% against NPC. Additionally, this accessory grants 35% more running speed and 500 energy. 35% more speed? Okay, now let's try the speed. Does it work in day and night? It didn't say that it only works at night. So it should be working in day. We're gonna test the speed on this bridge again once it turns nighttime. And it's now nighttime. The time to beat is 30 seconds. Is it gonna be faster than 30 seconds? In 3, 2, one go okay let's see i feel like it's a little bit faster 15 seconds in 20 seconds and 22 seconds that was really fast with the ghoul mask you're actually way way faster it's time to hunt down some humans human you're going down i missed i can't even hit him with a gun without the letter j okay headshot oh i'm strong I'm actually really strong. How many mastery are we gonna get from this one? Yo, the gun is actually pretty strong. I might be a gun main from now on. Nah, I'm kidding. That's a lie. Okay, let's get this gun to level 303. Two, one. And just like that, our mastery is now 321. Now, let's check out the skills. We got the heat sinking shot and the hellfire shower. Let's try the first one. Heat sinking shot. That's pretty good. Okay, we got fruit detected. This video is the lucky video. So if you like the video right now, you're gonna get lucky too. You're gonna get what I'm gonna get right now. And we are 62 meters away. It's now four meters away. Three meters away and we are getting a... What are we gonna get, Kai? What are we gonna get? What do you think we're gonna get? My guess is we're going to get a Buddha. Buddha. Okay, Buddha. Let's see if it's gonna be Buddha. Oh, ho, 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 ho. <laughs> this is actually pretty good portal we just got a portal fruit from the new fruit notifier we are getting lucky so you want to get lucky do what you gotta do okay now we're gonna check the distance for this gun okay from this distance it's good okay we're good how about this far oh we're still getting it we're still getting it okay how about this far oh we're still getting it okay now okay let's go about this distance right here Ah, uh, did this... It didn't hit? Okay, that... I think that is the range. How about the skills? Oof! The heat-seeking shot made it! Okay, let's go a little bit far for the heat-seeking shot. Now, this is a little bit far. But let's see if it's gonna... And that is for sure supposed to hit. Okay, I'm gonna switch screen, okay? This is my point of view. And the gun is... The bullet disappeared before it got to me. Okay, I'm just gonna go a little bit closer right here. And then I'm gonna shoot again. And the bullet is disappearing. So it's not that far. How about the hellfire shower? This is the hellfire shower right here. Hellfire shower. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Okay, okay. This one looks like has a distance. How about this far? Boom! Okay, that's good. That was good. That was good. Okay, let's check out this distance. Ooh, we still got him. We still got him. We still got him. That's a little... That's so far already. Okay, this far. Actually, Bizarre Rifle has a very good range. Okay, this far. Let's check it out. Ooh. Oh, it disappeared. We're gonna switch point of view. And it's going to disappear right in front of him. Now it's time for me to awaken the black hole and dark bomb. Let's get this one. And we are ready. And our fourth awakening. This 
for the black hole, I think. How much will you charge me, Ascension? C ability. Now it's called black hole. After awakening it, it is now called the endless hole. And our fifth awakening for the dark bomb. Yes, hopefully I have enough fragments for this one. 5,000 fragments. Do I have enough? Of course, maybe. And right now it's called the dark bomb. And it's now called the world of darkness. Ghoul V3. How do we get it? We talk to Arrow. And Arrow, what do we have? You're the son of Rip Indra. I am. Excellent. Talk to me again once you defeat five players. Here's what we're gonna do. Can we just defeat two players? Getting five bounties. We're gonna try. Let's see if that is going to work. Okay, we found a noob over here. We're gonna kill this noob three times. And then we're gonna find one more noob. We're gonna use the dimensional slash. Oof. We're gonna use the abyssal darkness. The Endless Hole. And the World of Darkness. Ooh, come here, noob. He, ooh, 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 the noob is dead. The level difference is too high. Okay, let's try to kill it five times. Let's see if it's going to work, okay? Let's kill him five times. Okay, that is the second kill. Ooh, that was our third kill. That's our fourth kill. Our fifth kill. But for safety measure, let's do one more. And that's our sixth kill. Is this going to work? Is that meta going to work? We're gonna find out right now. Let's see if we are going to get the ghoul v3. Well done. Yo, you just have to kill one person five times. That's all you gotta do, okay? Hey, before we do this, what is the difference between ghoul v2 and ghoul v3? Okay, ghoul v3 unlocks an ability named heightened senses. While activated, allows the player to use skills that are still on 40% cooldown. Buffs the player overall damage by 10%, speed by 10%, and defense by 15%. Last 8 seconds. Cooldown lasts for 25 seconds. And the V3 also lengthened the horns. Okay, this is what I look like right now as a ghoul V2. Once I get ghoul V3, the horns are gonna grow. Let's try that right now. And we just unlock the new title, Hellbound. And look at my horns. Dun dun dun! Oh my goodness! Look at the horn. Yo, look at this. This is a beast right here. It also says once it's activated, it gives 10% speed. Now let's try the speed again. In 3, 2, 1, go. Oh, it's not going straight. It's not going straight. Here, 7 seconds. 9 seconds. Are you slow? You see this how slow it is? 18 seconds. So this was the time to beat. And this is the time right now. 18 seconds. Yo, this is so fast. We are now one version away from Ghoul V4. For us to become the captain of the hunter ship, we need the shadow fruit and the Ghoul V4. Before we do that, let's try to pray. If we pray as a ghoul, what can we get? You finish praying. We got nothing. If you pray as a ghoul, you get nothing. How about try my luck? Nothing happened. Maybe you should come back later. Nothing happened. If you pray, nothing. If you try your luck, nothing. How about the death king? Give me bye. Oh, we just got the golden sun hat in first try. What is that? The Okay, what do we have here, sir? I see that accessory grants you 10% more damage on any attack and 500 health. Golden Sun is actually pretty good. But unfortunately, we gotta take it off. Now let's see who's gonna accept this offer. They should accept it really fast or else they're gonna miss out on it. A few moments later. Oh, ho, ho, ho. we got a shadow over here. Is this going to go through? And we just got the shadow fruit. It is now time to eat this shadow fruit. And we're now closer to becoming the captain of the haunted ship. How much mastery do we need for this one? We need 300 mastery. And the bad part about this one, it's not Logia. Let's try to level up right now. Yes, sir. Ooh, how many levels are we getting? 55 on one NPC. The flight for Shadow is so good. I can damage the NPC by just flying around him. Look. Let's see if we can kill it by just flying around him. Oh, no. It has a limit, actually. And we are now at 104. If you're low level and you want your mastery to level up fast, killing the smoke admiral is the best. It's easy to kill and it gives a lot of mastery. We are about to unlock our Corvus Torment. We are 298 mastery. This is going to be the last boss to kill. Boom. Gotcha! 302. Now that we unlock the Corvus Torment, we just need one more thing to be the captain of the haunted ship. And that is the Ghoul V4. 
four. Let's see if I can finish the castle with just using the shadow fruit. Pirates are raiding the castle. Let's see if I can do this. We are gonna gather all of them together and then boom then just fly all over them shadow is op show yourself tanky i see tanky right there come on die boys give me the fruit and yo this video is so lucky look at what we got we just got a control fruit i'm telling you if you guys like the video this is what we're gonna get and if you like the video this is what you're gonna get we just got a control fruit wow type in control in the comment if you guys want this control it's time for the good v4 trial yes we are finally doing the trials oh my god can we defeat all of these this is the biggest question everybody can we beat all of these with our shadow fruit 30 seconds left can i do it can i do it yes i did it but there's one more guy oh we did it there can only be one and that's going to be me three two one go fight yes we made it. We got our first V4. Let's go up here. Let's go up here. Let's go. Our first gear is unlocked. And we unlocked a new title. What was the new title? What was the new title? I didn't see. Let me know down in the comment right now. Oh, we gotta go. Can we get to our second trial? Oh, no. They're gonna be stronger now. They're gonna try to kill me. <gasps> no! Come on, come on, come on. We gotta finish it. I gotta finish this one. I gotta finish this one. No, the full moon ends. No. You know what we're missing? I think we were missing the gold mask. That's why we're not beating it. Now let's equip this on. Why is it unequipping it? I thought it's auto equip. Let's practice on this one. Come here. All of you. All of you come here. All of you come here. Ah! Let's go. What fruit are we going to get? Give me a good fruit because I keep dying. And you got to spin. Now we got to strategize. What is the best stats to finish that trial? Because I'm not max level right now. This is my stats right now. What should I put on my stats to defeat the trial? So we need a new game plan for this trial. First, we need to change our stats. There you go. Second, we're going to be turning on our V4 before. before entering the trial. And the third game plan is using my melee, my fruit, and my gun. Since we're going to be using our V4, we're going to have full stats. But remember, that's going to run out. And go V4. Activated. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Please work. Please work. Please work. Oh, my God. It's not freaking working. Okay. Let's see if we can defeat this one. Ooh. We got six seconds left. We got six seconds left. Come on. Come on. Yes. We did it. We finally did it. The game plan worked. And I need to get the domain expansion. Here we go. And our Ghoul V4 journey is almost over. We've got every version of Ghoul from V1 to V4. Fully awakened dark fruit. We have mastered the shadow fruit. And now we just became the captain of the hunted ship. A Ghoul V4. Four. Get ready for it.